Hi there. I want to talk about welding compound paths and purchased uh, things. This is a lettering delights file that I have traced. Oh, I guess I haven't. I thought I had because anyway, here's what I want to weld it to. And it's got a, a clear background, a uh, white background. So the first thing you have to do is trace it. And um, we're just going to uncheck the high pass filter and bring it over enough so that I look like it looks like the outline is solid. And I'm going to say trace outer edge. And I'm going to move it and make sure it did trace. And it did. So now what I want to do is take just the traced book for first. I have my two frames and I have to choose them both and make a compound path. Well, now I have two things. I don't know what happened there, but we'll just delete one. Uh, you're going to take this over and I'm going to overlap it. And I'm going to select everything. And then I'm going to, well, you can weld here or you can weld down here. I, I'm in the habit of right clicking and choosing all my stuff that way. Now, see, it's nicely welded. And then if you bring your graphic back over, and I would go use this up close uh, magnifying glass and use my arrow keys on my keyboard to line it up. And now when you print and cut, if you'll check the cut lines, it's going to cut, you know, Command-1 or Control-1 puts you everything back where it was so you can see the whole thing. And you can see that the cut line's going to cut just what you want. So if you print and cut, you're going to get just what you see with your lettering delights uh, little butter. I don't know if that's a lettering delights butterfly, actually. It's a butterfly. And um, that's all there is to it. 